be good. This is our preferred treatment for acne scarring. Um, I think for acne scars, there's nothing better than microneedling with energy. There's another one, here's another one within one of the other cases. So uh, this is our treatment for acne scarring. This is a lady that I did a facelift on, and you can see her scars, just the posterior area, but she had a little bulging in her neck, like a little fold of skin, so I treated her. So it kind of uses for touch-ups of different areas to and there's a few more companies um, out uh, than I have listed here. This is the insulated needles, meaning that the burn zones are going to be deep unless it's really superficial, which like the 0.5 millimeter, you get a little bit of epidermal injury. This sort of looks like the hybrid laser histology, doesn't it? But you get some tightening with this. And this is the non-insulated needles. Basically, you get basically a, like a fractional ablative laser. You're getting a deeper burn zone. So with the non-insulated, you definitely get some epidermal injury. So in the wrong patient, someone who's a little darker skinned may not be the thing you want to do. So I kind of like the insulated needles. And this is the Infini system, topical anesthetic or a nerve block, super easy. Usually three treatments, uh, a couple of weeks to a month apart. Okay, pretty straightforward, easy to use. Intracell is another company. So what's interesting is both the Lutronic Infinity and the Intracell are both Korean companies. I think there's a little patent infringement, and I hear that the two owners play golf together, so they're not really fighting with each other. But they're very similar technologies. We actually have both, and I really can't tell you which one's better, but they're really similar with a little disposable piece. Um, Cineron Profound is another one. We had this. I really don't like this. It goes in an angle. The needles are a little bit bigger. So I kind of like the other two insulated needles. These are some of the results. You get a little tightening with it. Nothing that impressive, but um, the ND Med's another company kind of showing you. You get a little red, but they really heal super quick from this. Um, Dr. Clementoni in Italy has done a lot of work with this with some really good tightening in some of his patients, but note he treats these patients pretty aggressively. But you know, for the pre-facelift crowd, it's pretty good. This is our preferred treatment for acne scarring. Um, I think for acne scars, there's nothing better than microneedling with energy. There's another one, here's another one within one of the other cases. So uh, this is our treatment for acne scarring. This is a lady that I did a facelift on, and you can see her scars, just the posterior area, but she had a little bulging in her neck, like a little fold of skin, so I treated her. So it kind of uses for touch-ups of different areas to tighten up some things. So 